Hey everybody, this is Brian, or a very large object, here giving you a review of the Logitech K380. So I got the 380 instead of the 480 um, keyboard, because it's, uh, well, it's a lot nicer, if you ask me, um, because it's a lot smaller. I can take this with me. Uh, and don't have to worry about, uh, you know, having a big giant chunk on the top here. Um, this keyboard is really, really nice. So, it actually feels about as nice as my laptop keyboard does. Um, and I have a ThinkPad uh, a P51S. Now this... This keyboard, you'd think the circular keys would be a little, uh, not so great. Uh, but touch typing is actually really, really nice with them. Um, and uh, the key stability is really good. Um, it feels like every key is um, uh, perfectly stable. Uh, there's no wobble going on here. And the general sound of it, if you can hear, It is pretty quiet. It's a very quiet keyboard. You can go into the library with this, and no one would really, uh, really uh, mind uh, you using it. Um, now it does. You are able to pair with, you know, one, two, three, three devices here. Now you're able to uh, swap them on the fly, um, and it does give you like an LED indicator telling you which one it is on. Now I only have one device in range that can actually connect to it, um, and that's the iPad, and that's uh, just uh, been reconnected there. So I can actually go to home, um, and then do the whole multitasking thing and go back to this, which, you know, an endless loop, which I don't think you'd want to really see that much. Um, so I'm going to be doing a lot of my, you know, typing with this keyboard here. I'm even using it at work um, to, well, because I work IT, um, I use, a, you know, a ticketing system. Um, and while I'm, while I'm navigating the ticketing system, I want to be able to be on the call and not have people hearing my, you know, my loud, loud, you know, keyboard. Uh, this is no longer an issue here because this keyboard's nice and quiet. Um, they don't really hear anything on their end. Um, I would recommend this to anybody who is looking for a for a nice keyboard uh, to either take along with them or use as a nice low-profile um, keyboard that uh, you know gets your. Uh, uh, all of your devices uh, easily within uh, controllable range, yeah. Uh, so um, it does have the simple keyboard functions such as home, multitasking, the right click options, uh, back, and all of that fun stuff. Uh, these two are specifically for Android. I'm not using any Android devices. Uh, but it, it it allows for all the function keys here to um, exist as well, which I think is pretty clever here. Um, <clears throat> now I'm mainly using this for my iPad because I like using the keyboard shortcuts to um, edit uh, videos and uh, edit music as well. Um, I am trying to get a little bit more into the musical side of things now. Uh, <laughs> not doing so great, but. Um, you'll see a little bit of that um, in this uh, video as well. So I hope uh, this has given you a very good um, overview of what this keyboard is. It's only $30 as far as I'm concerned at Best Buy. Um, that's where I got it. And for $30 you can't go wrong with this. It's a, it's a well-built keyboard. It's tough. It's, it has its nice rubber feet on it. Um, so it won't slide around when it's on the table, um, and in fact, it's 
it's a really nice comfortable keyboard to type on and can't really ask much more than that it has nice textured keys on it um, now it is made by Logitech Logitech makes some incredible peripherals that last years and years uh, beyond the time that I'd consider it useful um, and by that time I'd really want to replace it anyway um, just to have something new and fresh to 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 experience here um, I would I would give this a, a try if uh, you're looking for a new low-profile keyboard or if you're just looking for a keyboard that um, you have multiple devices that you need to connect up um, it's uh, definitely a lifesaver in that regard um, I'll see you guys on my next video. Um, I should, I hope I can be pumping out a little bit more videos, but I can't make any promises. You know how that is. Um, see you guys next time.